Scotiabank Saddledome in Calgary, Alberta, home to the Western Hockey League playoffs presented by Nutrien. Tonight, it is game number four of the Hitman Rebels best of seven Eastern Conference quarterfinal series. The Hitman hoping for a win to square this series at two games apiece, heading to Red Deer on Friday. Can't get one here. Yakumchuk took him to the corner. Puck goes in behind the Calgary net. Isley fights to get it out. Man draped all over him as Oliver Talk stabbed away by Williams, but kept in. Armstrong into the left corner for Red Deer. He'll scoot around behind, bring it out short side. Turned away by Peters. Husinecki will outlet to center, and he's got Hoylett trying to split through the defense. He gets it on the left wing. The beckoner stopped by Kelsey. Closes his eyes as Marinkovic was charging to the net. He created a blizzard. Now Adazinski will bring it in two on one with Yakumchuk up the left wing. Center to Yakumchuk. It got knocked into the corner. Adazinski trying to prevent that face-off win from happening. Line's been set, no puck yet. Now it's down, it's a lockup. Set off, got it high to mail, but he doesn't shoot it. He'll walk it, now he'll fire. Save, Peters, rebound, Groob. Turned it into the crease, Peters found it first. And the Calgary goalie gets some help from his defenseman. Slaney boxes out Groob, and Seatman takes care of King. And now Groob and Adazinski kind of mix it up after the whistle, and Groob has words for the official. Working the right wing hash ball, carry it low, pass it high, has Slaney. It'll go to the blue line, trying to spin away from Ollie Josephson. Got it to Yakimchuk. Yakimchuk, guarded by Josephson, steps to the middle. He'll take a shot. Kelsey to save the rebound behind, they score! Red light flashing behind Kyle Kelsey. Ethan Moore taps in a loose puck. Calgary's got the lead in game four. It's one to nothing. Calgary's already got two defensemen on the ice. This is a big decision for the coaching staff. Do you bring him across or do you send him onto the ice? He's going to go into the play. So Calgary's going to go with three defensemen. Shot Red Deer. King scores. So penalties costly. Red Deer's tied the game at one with a power play goal from former 50 goal man Ben King. Calgary's already got two defensemen on the ice. This is a big decision for the coaching staff. Do you bring him across or do you send him onto the ice? He's going to go into the play. So Calgary's going to go with three defensemen. Shot Red Deer. King scores. So penalties costly. Red Deer's tied the game at one with a power play goal from former 50 goal man Ben King. They're swinging their sticks, weaving the lanes. The puck is centered, tipped up high. Yakimchuk holds. Step around the defending Groob. Can't pull the trigger though. And Groob takes off. Two on one with Larson. Red Deer thinking another short handed goal. There's a pass. Larson to the net. The Deke scores. Second short handed goal of the period for Red Deer. And a 3 1 Rebels lead on the strike from Jet Larson. Joseph sit on the draw, wins it for Marinkovic to the blue line. Here's Lindgren, played it across. Mayo loads up the shot, he scores! Hunter Mayo from the blue line with an absolute laser beam into the top corner. And the Rebels, four unanswered goals, all in the second period, now lead it four to one. Red Deer man advantage, Lindgren at the line, down the wall, Groob on the right wing circle, back up top, here's Lindgren, walks across the line, left circle, Ben King, got a power play goal in front, Uchaz tied up by Seatman, puck to the boards, Moranoff ramming off Uchaz, but Groob's got the puck to Lindgren, now to King, left circle, shot, scores! Second of the night, a laser beam from the Ducks prospect, Ben King, smiles all around for Red Deer. They got a 5-1 lead in game four. Two short-handed goals, two power play goals for the Red Deer Rebels. Watch by Galloway, up top again to Groob. He'll carry it down to the right circle. Why not a push on him? Can't shove him off. Nobody can. Groob is big and strong, and he's been a key to this series for the Rebels. Puck goes high to King, down low. Uchaz, goal mouth pass off a of Hitman and in. It's 6-1 Red Deer on a fortuitous bounce. And the Rebels' third power play goal of the night. And Trey Patterson will hunt it down to the Calgary zone in the final five seconds now. Rebel bench is standing. They've come on the road in Calgary, and they've swept two games of the Scotiabank Saddledome to take a 3-1 series lead back to Red Deer on Friday.